Hello and welcome back. This is again my Casio G-Shock 1000 series aviator watch. I have had several videos about this. I've had an unboxing, had a six month check-in, a one year check-in, and I've had a drop test from 40 feet. If you want you can check all those out, but today I'm going to be doing a vacuum chamber test. I have not seen one of these yet. Should be interesting. Uh, I think the main issue that might pop up is there is air underneath this glass. It is sealed in there permanently. When you remove all the air from around the watch, the air inside of the glass is going to react interestingly to that change in pressure. And it's going to uh, affect the seals that keep it waterproof, and maybe even the glass itself. So worst case scenario, we might have a crack in the glass because the air inside does not have the same equalizing pressure from the outside. We'll see. Um, this setup is in my work. Uh, this is the vacuum chamber that we use uh, to put ink inside of ink cartridges that have been depleted. It can go, let's see, uh, I think bar uh, is, is measured in bar, the pressure. It can go up to negative one bar. And I've, I've stated it before, but this watch is rated for positive 20 bar. Uh, I, I, I really don't know how it's going to react to negative pressure. It's going to be interesting. Like I said, I've never seen this before. But I'm also going to put my Mobius camera in there with it so you can see a little bit better inside of this dome. Uh, We'll take it maybe, probably not up to the full one bar. Uh, I'll call out the numbers as it gets there. We might get to negative 0.8, uh, something along those lines. Uh, so it'll be almost as much of a test of the camera as it is of the watch. Um, but we'll see what happens. that dial up in the top right. Um, straight up is about negative 16 bar and all the way right here is negative 30. All right the Mobius camera is rolling, the watch is set up. I'm gonna put the dome on, make sure it has a good seal on there, vacuum, and on. All right, I thought about it. I really want to go for at least 20 bar, negative 20 bar that is. I've reattached these uh, needles that we use to put the ink in the cartridge. Um, so I think that'll probably fix the seal issue we were having. We will try this setup and see what kind of pressures or lack thereof we can create. Mobius is running. We are putting on this. Let me actually adjust this just a little bit. You can now read that dial, which is the pressure, or, you know, the, the lack of pressure, whatever you want to call it, inside of here. You can see the watch. All the hoses are intact. We should be able to get up past, may, maybe even, uh, past 20 bar. All right. Vacuum on. All right. You can see we're already up to five. Negative five. Negative eight. Negative ten. Yeah, it's going much better. Negative twelve. Come on. Negative fourteen. Negative fifteen.
problem. All right, I'm switching this off. This, this is fun. I'm not gonna lie. It's just in there like nothing's going on, but it's, it's, it's holding. It is doing amazingly well. All right, let's cut the vacuum. You can see the pressure drop down. We're back under five PSI, not PSI, bar. Take off the dome, and here's the watch. G-Shock, you continue to impress me. Keep doing what you're doing, because this is awesome. I love seeing the limits of how far it can go. I went in the opposite direction of the way it was designed to go as far as pressure, and it withstood it. I am constantly in awe. I seem to be doing one of these videos um, every six months or so. I've uh, done several in the past, like I mentioned, and I, I, can t I guess I will keep on doing them. They're lots of fun to make, and they're always very popular. So I see no reason not to keep uh, keep making them. So be sure to subscribe to catch more of this down the road. And uh, watch my other videos of this watch if you want. Um, I highly recommend this watch if you're looking for one. I think there's a new model uh, of this type of watch out right now. So again, I can't believe it. We went to negative 20 bar when it's rated for positive 20 bar. It's awesome. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.